Okay. okay, so we're inside the RV and we need to get down through the floor. So we need to lift up the, the trap so we can get at the exhaust to do the recall. And as you can see very clearly, the exhaust is where Nate's feetses are underneath those tiles which do not come up and there is no access the engineers really had their dunce caps on when they figured this one out all they had to do is make a little cutout and make that that little trap door a little larger it would have solved a whole lot of trouble but they don't think about stuff they got two-dimensional thinking they just make it look pretty so they can sell it and then get it out the door and heck with everybody else very irresponsible engineering they they really need to make these guys have to come out in the field and work on the crap that they design and then maybe they'll put their thinking caps on when it comes time to actually do the design on the drawing board and think about things a little bit more three-dimensionally so let's go down underneath and see what we got to deal with under there maybe we can get at it over there yeah it looks like they've got no access and I think if we take this tag wheel off, we can take that tag tire off of there and get into the wheel, the wheel well. There's a panel that comes off there that might give us some access in there. We'll give it a try. There's no way to get at it from underneath, even with a lift. So this is the corner they got us getting into here. <sighs> The exhaust pipe nice and straight heat shields intact I'm supposed to put the new heat shield in <clears throat> the welds have to be cut which is easy but easy-ish but then at the drill holes and attach the new bracket to this frame way up in there if you can see that no access through the floor because the engineers are basically ignorant so then we come around here they have a compartment more or less and there's the other half of that pipe but of course you can't reach anything and you can see from underneath is where the cutout is right there around the the engine there's no room not even for an idea but yet there is floor there they could have made a little cutout right up there above this exhaust that would have solved all the trouble but the engineers don't think of stuff like that So the only way to really get any access there is to find a little person or do more work and take out the def tank and squeeze up in that hole. So not a lot of thought put into the design, that's for sure. Uh, engineers, they are probably about the lowest form of life as far as mechanics are concerned. I think they ought to make a law they need to be out working on the stuff that they produce or design then they'll see what uh, what's going on and maybe use their brains at the, at the drawing table now that's it for me bye for now